Hello, Clarice Mertz here, the Brazilian one. And today we will be transforming little plates, simple as this one, that I don't know if you can see, simple as this one and something very beautiful. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> well, if you didn't see my table escape for Thanksgiving, go here and take a look because this is a project that I did for my uh, table escape. So what we will need? We will need uh, plates that you can see through, um, white glue, pencil, uh, brush, alcohol, a fabric or cotton to clean because the alcohol is to clean the plates and fabric of your choice. So let's see how to do is very easy and is very strong. You can you cannot use with hot food because glue and hot doesn't go together but you can use it for a dessert or for a salad it works very well uh, i did this as a test and look how strong it is and i already wash it very quickly a quickly wash like if you serve a salad or something just wash like try to wash just here on top not you know make it all wet just quick wash uh, dry with um, a cloth and it's good to go and when you get tired off you just put in the water take the fabric out and put a new one so it's a fun project I hope you like it so let's see how to do it so the first thing you do you choose your fabric I'm choosing my from uh, Thanksgiving so I choose this one that is matching with my placemate as you saw on my tablescape. If you didn't see my, my tablescape, go ahead and take a look because I have a cornucopia that you can do yourself in this project. So sure. you get your fabric and you get your place and you put your place on top of your fabric. Then you choose exactly what you want to be show in your plate. Okay? And then you cut a little bit bigger than your plate. So, like, like you put your plate on top of the fabric to see exactly where you want your uh, pattern to be, okay? And then you cut your fabric a little bit bigger and iron very well to not have any wrinkle on the fabric. Then you get a bowl. And you put your plate on top because it's easier to work here um, here than if it is flat on the table. You got some alcohol to clean the, the plate to not have any uh, fingerprint in your plate. So you clean it very well. You dry it. And you apply glue everywhere in your plate. Especially here on the end, you know, everywhere. Every single place needs to have glue. This is so easy to do and turn out so beautiful. I bought my plates on Walmart and I pay $1 on these little ones here. So when I have glue all over my plate, I get the right size, uh, side of my uh, fabric up and I put my plate on top. And then I get my bow back 
put my place on the top, top, top of my bow and I start to glue the fabric with my hands. If you have any wrinkle, you just pull and you glue again, okay? It's very forgiving, very easy to do. And now we will cut the left over here. Uh, here I cut very, uh, just enough because I um, really want to, you know, get all my, all my leftover fabric. So this was kind of danger here that maybe I could not make it. So then you go around, you cut your excess of fabric. I am in love with my little plates. See how beautiful. So now the last step, you put a coat of glue here to protect them a little bit more. You just put glue on top all over it. You can be very generous here. We are done. You let it dry for 24 hours and when it is dry I show you the way it looks like. So this was the project for today. I hope you like it and subscribe to my channel. Now on will be Tuesday and Thursdays until Christmas. Bye! See you there! Bye!